Hey guys, it's Predictus Times 2. I'm bringing you the first Times 2 show. And hope you enjoy it. So, um, the first Times 2 show is going to be about Metal Hollywood Fighter, but we're going to Black Ops 2 and Battle for Raw Data Access. Now the beta access for Battle 4 is when you pre-order Medal of Honor Warfighter. So once you pre-order that game, you will get exclusive beta access. If you cannot get Medal of Honor Warfighter, if you do not want to pre-order it, you can probably go find it on eBay or Amazon or something like that. But a lot of people will not want this code either and they might be making their money. As well, um, Medal of Honor War Fighter has an amazing trailer, so if you do go in the Medal of Honor YouTube, that, you know, it's got a really good trailer. I cannot show it to you because it's copyright, but once I get copyright proof, I will make a video showing you guys it. So, on really. Which is a bit ridiculous that it's been released for some of the I think, because, um, it's not like ten dollars more than the normal game which you really to play. It's like forty pounds in the game. So it's a bit sick. Well I then made a video to that on Fingerjuke.com. Um so obviously I'm going to access to Fingerjuke.com and let people make the websites. Um the Alice always got a bipolarity um which is found by guy who is the seven Design for much better detail. Um, well, he found this photo and I found it from him. Um, it's um, in the making of zombies and we're testing out the new maps. This, um, I know this is with the first map because the first map is actually um, based in a cafe and it's a, a cafe sort of thing. I'm not sure where it is, but it looks great for that. I can show you the video of it. Right, while they're making it, there's a the video on the project. You can go to the website and you'll be able to see the video of the you map being made. More Call of Duty info um, that um, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 zombie mode is in this multiplayer engine. Um, if you guys don't know what that means, it means you're now playing zombies in multiplayer and it's only X is the game which is amazing and there will now be post migration which means that you know, none of those stats will be lost unless you can not find a post and then most likely you will find a DC post. But as well in Call of Duty News, um, that there's going to be um, no zombie campaign. It's going to be the Easter egg and the Easter egg will be released into solo game mode and onto 4 versus 4 and on 4 game mode and will not be on the 12 player game mode. Um, I'm going on to more Call of Duty news, but there will be a couple of game modes on zombies. There will be 4 versus 4, which is where um, people verse each other. So four versus four, that would get the most points. Um, twelve people, which is an online that we're going to get more than, but it's um, just not a proper game. It's just this online, but you will have stats. Um, <coughs> the um, number four player will be online and um, private match. You can play on the zombie ma match and private matches and then the multiplayer match. And then private match you can change it to zombies and so on, which will be great. And now they've got a better theatre mode which will hold zombies, so you will be able to do this with zombies. So if you get the ring of iron so many you lose your friends, then you can go and put it in a file share, or if you want to upload it to a capture card, then you can go ahead and do that. 
is well um, and see it's moving maybe updating how long you can render a video to YouTube to a couple of minutes so that would be great for montages so you can have a longer montage and so on guys thanks for watching the time to share today and with this time to chat I hope you did enjoy this video and you got a little bit of more more fight in the and got more data at the same time um, and go to Black Ops 2 in the fight and next week I will be doing some more info on different games and if I do get any more info in this game then I will bring you the info so guys thanks for watching and then I will be back in a couple of days